A reader sent me a note over the weekend asking me about what I thought. Now, I say a note, a Facebook message. I mean, who uses emails? Who sends notes anymore? Just Facebook me, right? So, let me rephrase that. A reader sent me a Facebook message over the weekend asking me what I thought about another diet on the market. One you've probably heard of, the HCG diet. I've received a number of emails in regard to this diet, wanting to know, you know if it's healthy, can I lose weight, what do you think about it, should I try it? But after finally I say it's time, and that's why I'm here today, to bring you right here on my blog what I feel about HCG diet. Okay? You that know me, you know that you will not see me promoting any quick fix or fad diets anytime soon. And let me say this, this HCG, HCG diet is no different. Okay, that's why I'm going to once again reveal the truth behind another diet out there in this $50 billion weight loss industry. Okay, like, like always, I encourage you to do your own research. Do your own research, make an educated decision before taking anything. Don't just take what you hear from this blog on the internet and just run with it, okay? Now, let's start off. What is HCG? You've probably heard of it, but what is it really? HCG is a hormone that is produced during pregnancy. Okay? This hormone is produced by the cells that form the placenta in a pregnant woman's body. Pretty much, it is a pregnancy hormone. Okay? Now, HCG comes from pregnant women's placenta or from their urine. That's how they get HCG. I want you to hear this. The FDA has actually used this hormone um, to help treat some causes. All right? So the FDA has actually regulated and approved it. All right? Uh, male reproductive problems, they used it to be successful. They used it on uh, women who have difficulty getting pregnant and seen success. But all the research I've done, I cannot find anything at all by the FDA or scientifically backing that states HCG should be used as a weight loss product. I actually saw something by the FDA stating just the opposite. Okay? Now, you know what HCG is. How does it work? HCG diet what you're going to do is you're going to take injections on a daily basis uh, of this HCG hormone along with following a very restrictive diet. Okay? I say very restricted, 500 calories a day. So basically, the HCG, HCG diet combines the daily injections of the HCG hormone from a pregnant woman's urine with a very, very, very low calorie diet, 500 calories per day. Okay? The use of the HCG hormone, this is how they say you lose weight. They say that the use of it is going to release abnormal fat deposits in your body, make the fat available so that your body can properly utilize it. Some people have, you know, just can't burn fat, so this is going to help the body properly utilize the fat. Okay? They say that it's supposedly going to signal the hypothalamus, which is the area of the brain that affects metabolism, and by doing this, mobilizing fat stores, you're going to lose weight. Um, you've probably seen it on infomercials. You might have seen this diet in a book. Most people see the guy Kevin Trudeau, the infomercial guy, who you probably have seen selling the crap out of his product in his book, but he's really not even the guy behind it. Actually, he's in jail right now for uh, fraud, I believe, for misleading consumers uh, in, with all his weight loss scams. But a lot of times his name's associated with the diet, but he did not even discover it. The guy that found the diet is a guy, Dr. Simeon. So if you want to do your research, which I encourage you to do, check out Dr. Simeon. And from the research that I've done, this dude's a smart dude, this doctor. I mean, um, I think I read that he discovered some stuff, um, actually came up with a cure for some disease. But anyway, he's a smart dude. But for your own research, if you want to do it, there you go. Dr. Simeon's a guy, the name you want to Google. Um, here, here's my problem, okay, with this diet and why I want to caution you <coughs> on this diet. Excuse me. First off, let me say this. I know that people are desperate, and like you always hear me say, we're searching for an answer. I understand that. And that's why this industry is a $50 billion industry. But to me, this is just another weight loss method that shows how desperate we really are. And you're starving yourself. 500 calories a day, and while you're starving yourself, you're injecting yourself with a hormone from a pregnant woman's urine. How desperate can we really be? My first problem, the 500 calories a day. Anyone would lose weight eating 500 calories a day. So, I ask myself, and I've asked myself over and over again, and I want you to ask yourself the same question. Do the injections really work? I mean, do they have anything to do with it? Or maybe it's just a placebo effect. I don't know. 
But 500 calories per day is severely restricted. In fact, it's not even enough calories to support normal brain function in a human being. I've spoken to some people that have been on this diet, and they told me that they've been, when they were on it, they've been extremely irritable, would just flip out any time over anything. Um, I've spoken to people that have been depressed, down and out. You know, so I really ask you, I mean, even if you're losing weight, is it worth it to be miserable along the way? I don't think so. And think about this. Let's not think about you for a second, but what about all the people that are in your life, all your loved ones, the people that have to be around you on a daily basis? How would they feel to have to be around you when you're depressed, miserable, um, irritable, and all these different emotions that you're going to get from eating a very restricted 500 calories a day and your brain is not functioning properly? The other problem I have is from some stuff I read, they say that no exercise required. And I thought I also read that they actually tell you that one phase of the diet to not exercise. So there's my other problem. It's a diet when you know they're telling you not to exercise. Exercise has way more benefits than just losing weight, and you need to exercise for your overall health. I've read claims that people are saying they're losing one to three pounds a day when they're on this diet. Now, once again, let me state, there's no scientific evidence supporting HCG injections as a weight loss strategy, and the FDA is not backing it, all right? I've read numerous, numerous success stories all over the internet, but I've never met one person that has been successful on this diet. I've met tons of people that have, that have tried this diet and have failed at, it, have failed at it, but I've never met one person that's been successful at this diet. Okay? Um, I also want to caution you on this. You're, you're taking HCG, which is artificial, an artificial hormone, and you're putting it into your body. Let's not be naive, my friends. Of course, there's dangerous side effects. Anytime you take something artificial and put it into your body, there's possibly going to be side effects. Now, there was numerous side effects I read, but for me, the most dangerous part and side effect of this whole uh, diet is the restricted calories, the 500 calories a day. This is where the serious side effects can really take place in your body. All right? I truly believe, and I don't want you to be fooled, I truly believe this to be another fad diet that will come and go. It will be here and then it will be gone. So don't be misled, okay? It is definitely not the cure for obesity like you will read everywhere on the internet, okay? Do not forget, this is a $50 billion industry, okay? Um, what else? Let me ask you this question. So what do you do once you get off the diet? Diets don't last forever, all right? You're no longer taking the injections and you're living in the real world once again, are you seriously going to stick to 500 calories a day? Some people get that in one meal. Are you really going to keep, be able to keep the weight off? Did you learn anything about how to make losing weight a lifestyle? I don't think so. My answer would be no. So like most diets, you know what? This one will fail you. This starvation diet is not real life, people. I mean, think about it. How are you going to stick to it? It is another way for people to have the easy way out. I'm sick of the easy way out. If this is your last resort, okay, let me say this, and you've tried everything and you just can't lose weight and you're going to go get gastric bypass surgery and you're severely obese, you know what? I would recommend this diet over gastric bypass surgery or some of the other surgeries out there. I've seen people have died doing gastric bypass surgery. So I'd say that to say that's the one time I would recommend the diet, okay? Um, you'll still never be able to convince me that you can't lose weight. I don't care how much you weigh. Remember, if it sounds too good to be true, it usually is what? Too good to be true. Ladies and gentlemen, weight loss is hard work. I'm not saying you're telling you it's easy. And once again, I'm going to tell you, you're not, it's not going to come. You're not going to find any cream. You're not going to find any pill, infomercial gadget. And you're not going to find it in any injection. It's hard work. But everywhere you turn, what? People are wanting to try HCG diets, the latest craze. If you need to lose some weight and are looking for the easy way out, I really wouldn't take the chance here. I just wouldn't. You're taking something artificial, putting your body, so be that, but you are restricting to a 500 calorie diet. I would get off the couch and I would get a game plan that has worked for millions of other people in the world to lose weight. It's called exercise and nutrition.